Hello YouTube, this is LilKillerJK here, and this is actually my first actual video of gameplay. So, today we're going to be playing the new DLC which is called Scramble Nations on Sid Meier's Civilization V. And of course, have to be America, because America is the best. And Canada, I just want to let you know, you are part of our count. We're not counting you out, so everything's all good. So I'm, I'm recording this first, because it's my first video. And because I want to help you guys see if you want to buy this DLC. It may only be five dollars. Welcome, but President Washington. Let's see what I say. You lead the industrious American civilization. Formed in the conflagration of revolution in the 18th century, within a hundred years the young nation became embroiled in a terrible civil war that nearly tore the country apart. But it was just a few short years later, in the 20th century, that the United States reached the height of its power, emerging triumphant and mighty from the two terrible wars that destroyed so many other great nations. The United States so is yeah, a nation no one really cares. with optimism. So, excuse me. I'll sign off here. So I am bringing this today. So if you want to decide to buy this, consider I'm, sending your I'm hoping to explore new territory. that this will help you choose to buy it. It is only five dollars, but uh, Excuse you don't me. you don't want to waste your money on it. So yeah, obviously the goal is to I have some information take over maybe. the world because that's what Americans do. Let's change the options here real quick. The voice is probably a little loud. So yeah, we're just gonna play through this a little bit. Talk, see what deal is. So I I just started with pottery really because it doesn't honestly make a difference. Let's actually switch this. The city to screen worker. provides a detail. So we need to start with city's growth and production. I'm just gonna have this little warrior thing. Look around. I want to go to this because if you don't know, these are usually like ruins or something and they can get you money or oh, it's a city just have to go and find out but since uh, if you don't know or if you never played Sid Meier's 5 walking in the trees slows you down so pretty easy concept when you're in the trees you're slower so yeah I'm going to record this in about 10 minutes these in 10 minute sections just so they're easier to watch and I'll put key things on like a title screen to say so you can see if you want to jump to certain parts, you can jump to certain parts. But for now, this is just going to be this so far. Let's go meet this nation. Let's see who it is. We got William of the Netherlands in America. Well, that's interesting. I didn't know they were in America. Oh, it actually looks like I could be kind of in Britain or uh, Africa. Well, no, it doesn't really matter because it's soon all going to be mine, anyways. <laughs> so, since this is my first video, most of you probably don't know what I'm going to be doing with this channel. Hopefully, I'm going to do some custom FTB mod pack that one of my friends made. Civ 5, Gary's Mod, Prison Architect, Kerbal Space Program, and whatever other stuff I happen to buy. So, yeah. I would recommend buying this game. I bought it over the Steam Summer Sale, so I got it for cheap. Got it for $15. This is the Gold Edition, which is even better, or premium, whatever, because it came with all that stuff. That I would have had to pay for normally. And I didn't want to do that. So we're going to do this animal husbandry next because it allows you to bring in more food, which is important for growing your cities because your cities need food to grow. We've got barbarians. If I clear them out, I get money. So we're going to stop the automation here. We're going to eventually route them over there. Right 
already. So here we go. So next, I'm hoping, or in the future, the I'm hoping unit you are to near do a fortified. Thank you. I don't care. In the future, I was hoping to One do like units is near an enemy a unit. speed run, you know, kind of like Civ oh. speed run. How long it'll take me to completely dominate the world, which would be pretty fun. I'd want to do it. My goal would be to do it in under an hour. It's just my hope, but I think it would take a little longer than an hour, just because how long the initial startup takes, and there'd be problems like. Mr. Hamsterdam here would get too strong, or some stupid shit like that that would impede total American dominance, any tiles which would be much of a shame. Order no, bitch, shut to... up. So, I do a scout now so we can have explore more of the world. I'm just gonna sit there and wait. Maybe they'll do something stupid and I can attack them, which would be fun. So that now, once animal husbandry comes up, we can get Bowser. these here sheeps. Now let's do. I usually do the shortest one, just because you can get more stuff. So obviously, since we are America, we have to do liberty. I mean, what's more American than the policy designed for America? I mean, nothing. So we're American, and that means we have to do liberty. Set these scouts to automatically explore. You know what? Ancient ruins oh, all right, we got some ancient ruins up here. Apparently, that is a yellow dot. Let's build another warrior, so I can get. Mu oh, oh, those assholes took it. What douchebags? So they there could have been some technology or something up there usually money you may get free tech or armor upgrades pretty much anything but they they took it from me so ooh, boot trust they are cultured friendly and they have whales that's very nice let's keep going around it looks like he might have built another city So let's go over here. Construct a pasture. And get our next turn. I think I might want to move those out of there so they don't get killed. No, 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 no. No, no, no. And anyway, it's important to build those because they get you more food. Just leave those guys there. Mining. Ooh, another ancient ruins. Hopefully, they don't seal them from me, which it looks like they're going to. Where are those mine? Oh, they are mine. Would you look at that? No one's taking those from me this time. Just have them fortify because it looks like they want to attack. But no one tackles the American spirit! Can't take down America! In America, we are the supreme power. And I, I'm thinking this is America, but this actually looks like Africa. As you can see, I got 85 gold from that, which is important for like building stuff. So it's gonna have them automatically scout around. Yeah, it looks like I am in Africa, where like, whatever countries there are, I don't know, I'm not cultured, I'm American. And nothing else matters when you're American. I build a shrine so we can get my own religion going, which we'll call American Christianity. <laughs> kind of a mouthful, but we're American. And who gives a shit what anyone else thinks? Because that's how Americans do it. In America, we're supreme. Oh look, the Queen of England. We are pleased to meet you. Ooh, I bet you are, little Miss Ugly Hair, little ornament lady thing. I'm going to talk British now, because I've now met the Queen of England. She probably thinks she... Oh man, oh man. 
That w that was dumb. Now now I have to kill you. You made me do it. Actually, no. I just keep sitting there. Well, where is the Queen of England? I don't think. Oh, my I people like to smile the most. That's nah, very nice. So, let's adapt a new policy. We got citizenship or republic. I'm gonna go with republic for now, even though I will eventually get all of them. No, I'm not gonna kill him yet. Oh, ooh, very nice. I probably should avoid that. Steer clear for now. Just continue on his path down to here. Next turn. We gotta get the archer and the temple of Artemis. That's a very nice name. I think I would go by Artemis if I was a temple. Make a farm. While well, I was sitting here thinking about YouTube in general today, I was trying to think. So, like, guys like PewDiePie have thousands of hours of video, and they can think of something to talk about constantly. Oh, shit. They're really. So, they think of this crap talking. I don't know exactly how, what I'm going to talk about all the we time, no but do not fear. I, I talk way too much, so I will always think of something to talk about. Like today, let's get the hell out of here, was the Apple press conference with the iPad Mini. I don't know, it's all that good stuff, I don't know if you knew about that. It is October 21st, so if you're watching this in the future, or October 22nd, sorry, wrote all the wrong dates on my test today, I'm not crazy. Uh, so yeah. I'll, I'll think of something to talk about. Do not fear. You will always be mildly entertained. I'm not really saying super entertained, but mildly. I think I think if if you work with me, if you if we work together as a brotherhood of my subscribership that is soon to grow. I have a grand total of five right now. This video is recorded. But if we work together, eventually we will be something great. And you will be the power behind it. And that would just be epic. You would help some kid in this small town in some far off, oh shit, some far off place make his dream come true. Now I'm not saying you have to subscribe to me but if you don't subscribe, I'm afraid I'll have to fry a little cat. Ah, yes, that'd be very tragic. Alright, so we're about at our tenth minute. So, that is the end of part one. We're in 2700 BC, and America is doing great. So, make sure, like, subscribe, and come back for the next video. Adios.